Hi, I'm Joseph Gower. I'm a carpenter and general builder, and I'm here currently renovating my own home. We're gonna start by cutting this laminate to fit around the radiator pipes. I'm gonna line up the laminate, and then I'm gonna mark on the laminate exactly where the pipes are and cut them with a the Dremel. After that, I'll use this off cut at the back to fill in the distance between the existing laminate and the skirting board. I'm gonna use the tape measure I'm going to check how far in we need to make the cut. So it's two centimetres in. Now using a set square, I'm going to get a nice straight line. Now we have our marks on the board, ready to cut it with the Dremel. Okay, then we place the laminate on the workbench. We make sure it's clamped down firmly. That prevents it from slipping around when we make the cut. I already have the 561 spiral cutting bit inserted in the Dremel, and now I'm gonna attach the cutting guide. The laminate, I know, is six millimeters thick, so I'm gonna set the depth to 10 millimeters. I'm using the multi-purpose cutting kit instead of a jigsaw because it's quite small cuts and you have a lot more control and stability using the Dremel. I've set the RPM to 30,000. That leaves a really nice, clean and smooth cut on the laminate. Okay, we have a nice, perfect cut there. Let's go and put it around the radiator pipes. Okay, we're gonna line up the laminate with the pipes. The cut's perfect. Now we're gonna get the off cut and put it behind. If you need to, use one of the metal bars and a wooden mallet and use that to pull in the laminate. Now what I'm gonna do is use the one centimeter spacer, put it between the wall and the laminate. That allows for any movement in the laminate over the years. Now we use the radiator collar to go around the pipe. This will hide any discrepancies and also leave a nice finish. Okay, the collars are now on. I think it looks perfect. I hope you have some tips and tricks for yourself when you're renovating a home or moving into a new place. All the best, good luck.